Hi world, it's Chatty Dive One here today with you. Um, excuse the sunglasses, I got a pretty good headache right now. And, uh, I'm a bit ticked off and a bit stressed out. Um, got a little bit of information here for y'all about the Affordable Care Act, which I've uh, talked a little bit about. I haven't run upon this so far yet in the bill in this monster bill thousand pages more um, <clears throat> I received this letter from uh, my local insurance agent who provided me and h hooked me up with insurance in uh, 2008 and uh, you know I, I thought I was grandfathered in to an insurance plan that I could keep that our dear president said you you'll be able to keep your health care coverage your insurance if you like it you'll be able to keep your doctor blah 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 and friggin lie liar okay I want to read you this letter that I got um, and then I'm going to show it to you I, spilled some stuff on it. It was a little smudged. And I blacked out some areas so I don't get a uh, some freaking violation or something. But um, anyways, it says this. With the new regulations surrounding the Affordable Care Act, we're happy to let you know that you can can uh, that you can keep your current Florida plan until summer 2014 until the summer 2014 in the meantime you can also review a new plan now available to help you decide if you change your plan now would be to your benefit just give us a call or stop in at our office Don't give up your plan. Don't give up your plans. Whatever you do, keep it until 2014, summer of 2014. That's what I intend on doing it. I am not going to get on Obamacare because that's a nightmare. No way am I going to do that. No way. My insurance has almost tripled since I got it, okay? Let me continue on. Um, tax credit eligibility. You'll be eligible for a premium tax credit from the government. You can find out how much you might qualify for by using the online estimator at Florida Health Care Form. Dot to keep your current plan, do nothing. You can keep your current benefits until the summer of 2014. At which time we'll contact you to select a new plan. I ain't got no choice. I thought I had one. I thought I could keep the one I had. I thought I could keep the one I liked. Yeah till 2014 in the summer friggin liar liars liars in the government our governments full of liars um, Your plan will be in effect as long as you continue to pay your premiums on time, which I have, even though it's tripled. Um, feel free to give us a call, blah, blah, blah. You can also get plan recommendations online. Otherwise, we'll follow up with you about six months 
to review your new plan options for when your plan does need to change. And I thought I was grandfathered in. I thought this was a grandfathered in thing. There is no grandfather. The grandfather dies in the summer of 2014 and you're left on your own. You got to get a new plan. Excuse me, I'm, I'm a little bit ticked off right now and my friggin' head hurts. I'm sorry, I apologize, y'all. This is just. <laughs> oh, man. As always, thank you much for entrusting us to handle your health insurance needs. Sincerely, blah, blah, blah. P.S. Um, you may receive information or hear claims about other health plans that sound too good to be true. You can count on us to provide you with expert, accurate information. Answer your questions in the future. Um, to continue un uninterrupted benefits. <laughs> Don't you love it? Don't you love it? Don't you love having a government and a president who's going to stand up there and lie? We've got a Senate and a Congress who says, we've got to pass the bill to find out what's in it. Well, I'll tell you what's in it. A pack of lies and a bunch of crap. You know that the questions that you'll be asked, or if you have firearms, do you have firearms in your home? And believe me, they'll know if you got a friggin firearm in your home if you got one insurance premiums go up if you got one they'll come out to your house and check and make sure it's stored safely and properly make sure your ammunition is stowed away safely and properly if you got children in the house with firearm a little bit more a little bit more Kick you, kick you again. <laughs> man, man. Uh, I'm going to show you this right now. Um, so, so you'll know I, I'm not full of it. Um, do this the best I can. I hope y'all can see that. See that though? With the new regulations surrounding the Affordable Care Act, we're happy to let you know that you can keep your uh, plan until the summer of 2014. In the meantime, you can also view the new plans now available. Okay? To keep your current plan, do nothing. You can keep your current benefits until summer 2014 at which time we will contact you where's this flip page receive your new plan options for when your plan does need to change See that down there? Sounds too good to be true. There's going to be uh, scammers out there, I guess. I don't know. 
And I got another issue that's been going on that's bull crap. I've got a loved one that has had some severe problems. Some severe back problems, okay? They needed an MRI. Went to the doc. Hasn't had one for 10 years. The last one showed degenerative disc disease, this and that, and all kinds of stuff. Okay. They're treating them like dirt right now. Well, not now, because we've taken steps to make sure they're taken better care of and treated better. We found a little loophole here. You know how these MRIs are supposed to be so expensive? Well, they, listen to this. The insurance denied the MRI and the x-ray because the doctor said the x-ray they're gonna have to do that first before they approve the MRI and he basically told my loved one family member that they have a whole army of office workers above this medical uh, little doctor's offices, this little medical center. The whole top floor is full of people trying to work around the paperwork and trying to keep them running. The doctor told, the doctor said, I just come here and go to work and be a doctor and do, I, I just do all I can just to do the best I can. And he's not able to do what he needs to do. He can't even write an MRI and get it to get done. Because the insurance company will deny it. Well, they said it, it's denied and then they, uh, and then my uh, loved one had to go to the emergency room two days later. They did an x-ray there, but said that they couldn't do an MRI that would show any soft tissue damage or anything like that. Even with a history of degenerative disease for over 10 years, this person has, my family member. And I'm, I'm sick of watching them suffer. There's so many people suffering right now. The same crap. The insurance companies are denying them getting an MRI, saying it's too expensive. Well, guess what? I found a place that does MRIs for $200 out of pocket. 200 bucks. Two hundred dollars out of pocket. And they're saying it's too expensive? Wow. And there's a lot of people in this same boat right now in my community. Other family members that we are now informing them about the two hundred dollar MRI and where they can go. They'll have to travel a good little bit but you can go get it done and you don't have to ask the insurance company you pay 200 bucks and it's done and then your doctor gets the results and he can do what he needs to do because he's got the evidence to back up whatever if he needs to write you a narcotic or a freaking Valium or a muscle relaxer or whatever man whatever okay whatever this person needs to stop suffering and to not become an alcoholic trying to self-medicate or a freaking street drug addict or killing their liver by taking too many Tylenol or ruining their stomach with ibuprofen and aspirin, okay? And they've already been to the hospital with ulcer bleeds because of taking too much aspirin and ibuprofen. And the Tylenol is killing people's livers. It's ruining people's liver. 
they're starting to pull all the 500 milligram Tylenols off the shelves. That ain't going to stay. They're bringing it down to 250. So now you're going to pay double for your Tylenol. It's coming. It's coming soon. It's coming real soon. We got a friend at the uh, that works at a at a drugstore, and and they said, if you want to come ahead and get the uh, Tylenol, 500 milligrams, um, this um, ichthymol ointment stuff, and uh, something else. Um, I can't remember what it was. To come and come and get it now because it's fixing to disappear off the shelves, and it's fixing to become 250 milligram Tylenol, and no ichthymol. That'll be a prescription. But um, anyway. Yeah, we got the MRI done. Now my family member is finally getting the help that they need. But we had to go around about this way. Just bypass the insurance company. Find a place that will bypass the insurance company and help you do it out of pocket. I don't know if you can find a place. If you can't, let me know. I'll let you know where to go and what to do. You may have to travel a little ways, but it's 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 there. And you can get a scan done for 200 bucks of your lower back for 200. If you need to get a a scan of your lower back and your neck, that's 400 because that's two scans, okay? They take credit card, they take cash, debit card, and they take insurance. But uh, the insurance company will deny it. Out of pocket. Won't. Anyway, I, I, I'm i just ticked off about this, about my, my plan that's going to have to change in the summer of 2014. Must change. I don't know why. I was told I could keep my insurance plan if I liked it. And I like it. Even though I'm paying triple for it from when I got it. I still like it. My gosh, I don't know what kind of plan it's going to... I'm going to have to whip up next. I might have to get two or three different insurance plans. And who knows how... How the hell much it's going to cost me then? Excuse my language. But um, this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. This uh, unaffordable health care act is an abomination. And so is our government. I'm telling you, this act is there to kill the middle class. Okay. My family member, without help of something, would have probably lost their job. But thank the Lord right now they're able to go back and work and deal with it. They're able to continue on. And we're middle class. We work our butts off. We work as hard as we can to do what we got to do. You know, we have family, we got kids, uh, you know, but they're trying to wipe us out. Anyway, I, I just had to let y'all know about this. Um, you know, they're, they're dumping people left and right, but 2014, summertime, everybody's stuff's going to change. I'll be having fun with you. Good luck to us all. God help us all. God bless us all. I love y'all. Y'all are the best. I have the best subs on YouTube, I believe. I really do. You guys are all awesome. And I appreciate you watching this and taking the time out. 
This chatty dad one, never give up your guns. It's the only thing we have left to keep us from total tyranny. Over and out.